Yeah, what do you know? Another video, an awesome pickup in this bundle of figures that I got. I'm just doing these all in singles. I'm trying to keep these videos shorter. Shorter. Look at that Lumat. Excellent card, unpunched. Got this for an excellent deal. Um, it's got a couple more of them. I was tempted to get them all off them, but it's not like I'm in the business of wanting to buy and sell, really. I'd say it's at least a C8-5. It's got some edge wear, but that's more of the cut, I believe, from the factory. Beautiful uh, back of the card back. There's a couple on here I don't have. Pardon me, it's VC-104. Lumat, looks great figure. You know, it looks pretty accurate too. And they even kind of get the face pretty good. Fair good, I mean a little more white in there. I think you could do, they could do better if they do this, since I think they're re-releasing this figure, so he will be uh, dropping in value. Return of the Jedi card. I'm not sure if there's a revenge of the Jedi card on him, but uh, anyways, I got a lot of these now. Slowly but surely. Actually, there's a lot on here I don't have. No, I think of it. Never mind. Um, Soka. I don't know. I had the option of getting that one, but you know, for the money, I already got the new one. I just, I don't even, the 2.0 TBC. So, anyways, 2012, this, this figure came out production. There it is. But uh, definitely a key figure that I, this brings back memories because I'm pretty like 99.99% positive. I had him literally on this uh, Return of the Jedi card uh, back in like 84 or I think maybe 85, 86 I got him. But uh, I love the Ewoks and that's a pretty damn awesome figure. Do you know what? I love how the bubble doesn't... Uh, they're not doing this ridiculous bubble. And look how they pack everything in there. Why can't they do that anymore? Anyways, great condition. Beautiful figure. Um, he goes for quite a bit of money. But I got this for a really good deal. So there's, I find there's a lot of this stuff out there. You know, if you're patient. Um, I don't know. You talk to the guy. Maybe buy him bundles. You know, maybe the guy will cut you a bit of a deal. Especially if he knows you're a collector. I'll never sell these. I'm not doing this for money anyway. So... It's, it's uh, you know, this will all end in probably best case scenario. Eventually it'll end up as landfill or something, you know, depending on where Star Wars goes in the next 30 years. But uh, anywho, cheers to the next video.